HMA-167 is the first squadron on the East Coast to receive the AH Tac-1 Zulu. So the big differences between the uh, Whiskey and the Zulu from a maintainer standpoint is that it is about 85% commonality with the UH-1Y. So what that means is from a maintenance standpoint, that reduces our logistical footprint, uh, reduces training requirements, and then overall uh, the dependability of the aircraft is a lot better. From a pilot perspective, I would say it's easier to fly, it's safer to fly, and it reduces pilot workload and uh, builds pilot situational awareness to a level that uh, the whiskey never could. When you look at the technological differences, you know, the whiskey has a lot of Vietnam era technology in it. And what the Zulu really does is brings the Marine Corps into the 21st century.